I personally, I don't know where you land on this, and I know there's a big debate in actually the political commentary world because people love talking about sports here when they're done tired of talking about politics. Um, I am still a big fan of college athletics, and I think it can be really helpful, but also destructive in a lot of ways. Um, and I just hope that, like, I don't know, it it would be nice if we came back to some standard of strength again, but without all the bullshit that's happened. But can you have that? I mean, can you have a good team without everything else at this point, without spending that kind of money on a program? I mean, you know, I don't know if, if you saw this in the news or something, but um, the University of Alabama at Birmingham just decided to close their football program. It's the first major closure, I think, in uh, quite a few decades. Um, and other schools are also looking at this. And, you know, Michigan isn't the only school where student attendance is down. Student attendance at a lot of games is down. Right. And, and then you have all these schools saying, we're not turning a profit anymore. These programs are costing us so much money. Well, what are you, what are you spending the money on? You know, right. these, there are expenses. It's a, so I think a lot of colleges are having to sort of take a long, introspective look and, and think about, what these programs mean to them, what it means to them to be competitive at a certain level in football and basketball, especially, but you know, all sports um, and what kind of decisions they want to make going forward. Michigan, you know, more so than anyone. You're not going to, you, you look like you're almost going to offend me. Like by saying something about Michigan, don't go right ahead. Oh, no, I have no <laughs> issues. Like I said, my, my dad was a fan growing up. I, they're not Notre Dame. But, you know, that's it. Hold on. <laughs> right. We're not Notre Dame. Let's be clear on that. Um, okay. Yeah, I don't, you know, honestly, I kind of think it's kind of a good idea. I kind of feel terrible saying that, but I kind of think for a lot of programs, it's just kind of a waste. And even at Michigan, uh, the new president, uh, Schlissel, I'm, I think I said his name wrong. Um, yeah, yeah uh, he has said he comes from this really, he comes from Brown and Berkeley. And you feel sorry for the guy because he was thrown into this big football culture, but he's like his... Right big campaign thing or his big promise has been student affordability. And, you know, like every traditionally great program, Michigan's football program gets a huge amount of money, right. like an insane amount of money and influence. A lot from private donors. Right. And right. And so, you you know, private donors write the check and they, they don't say, here's the money, do what you want. They say, I want this to go to right. the football program. And I want to be able to point to my friends in the skybox and say, that was me. Who cares about, you know, the importance of the lit department or something? Yeah, I think then that's the question is, you know, are these programs coming at the expense of, other, you know, if they're privately funded or whatnot, you know, how much do they impact the rest of school and how much do they benefit the rest of school? How much do students really want this? I think, um, you know, there is a strong appetite still for college football at a lot of schools. Um, and the question is kind of be evaluating how good does that football have to be? Right. How strong these? And I, I think Michigan is a good example of a school where you know what? If it's not that good, attendance is going to go down. Enthusiasm is going to go down. So, so what does that mean going forward? It sounds like Mina. It sounds like you're really asking what? How far is Michigan going to suck before it either gets better or they get rid of the program? I think it's going to be a long time because I think Michigan is the most conservative of conservative schools in terms of keeping its football program, um, but. Uh, you know, it's dark now and everybody's been assuming that, you know, this is the darkest of it, but it could get, you're right. It could last a while. I don't really know. 